Hello, this is Catherine's Low Income Prepping slash Survival number 61. All right, so right now I'm using my phone this time. So here we go. The first thing I'm going to do is talk to you about uh, I went out the other day and I picked up a hug grip and I picked up a couple of other items, some ammo cans and a sleeve for my uh, 45 that's actually going to be inside a backpack, inside that large Kelty backpack. Um, it's the best I can do. I want it concealed and out of sight. Um, but what I'm going to do today is show you what I picked up. And I got a hug grip. The hug grip, uh, I actually wrapped it up for Christmas. Uh, it's one of those over molded grips that's in um, kind of a desert color, kind of a tan color. It's kind of hard to explain. But anyhow, here we go. Um, sorry for the picture and shaking and anything else that's going on. All right, I'm going to flip you around so you can see what I'm doing. And there we go. All right. So a while back, I had bought some of this um, for $199 a box. It's um, match 69 grain, um, bow tail hollow points. And I got them mainly so I had a larger, heavier round to hunt with. I also had bought some of these um, 40 grain for smaller animals, and I also had bought some uh, 55 grain, two, two, three, four. This is a soft point, and this is a ballistic point on this one. So, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put them in snack bags, basically, as you can see here, and I'm going to put them inside these ammo cans I bought. Now, as I said, I got the hog thing wrapped up, so I really can't show you. But this is a Walmart ammo can, and as you can see, it's pretty much like Harbor Freight ammo cans. It's kind of like um, Tractor Supplies ammo cans. There's a nice gasket that runs around, and it's got the same kind of closures that all of them got. Let's see, there's the name on the side of it. Ammo box. It's called Strategy. This is Walmart, believe it or not. Yep, I got this over at my local Walmart. And then over here, I got this sleeve. And it's got the molly on the back. And it's got a strap to carry, as you can see. And uh, it's got some D-rings on it where you could tie it on stuff. It's quite long. So most of my 45 long Colt rifle fits in there. I'm going to try to get back here far enough for you to see it. There you go. But anyhow, um, it's got a little strap right here that holds the... Uh, you can put through your trigger guard or your ring on your um, lever action. And it's got this piece here and the little clip here. So you can shorten it for a shorter firearm. All right. Uh, let's say you go with one of those shock waves or... One of the other different brands. Uh, you don't need all that extra. You can close it up. So I got this stuff. And I see I got some green chip back here. I got the green chip in the magazines right now. And mainly that's just in case. I kind of loaded the magazines up after the stuff about the um, Israel thing and everyone being attacked. So anyhow, I just wanted to do a short video here to uh, show you how things work out, what I've got. And uh, so Walmart, uh, yeah, I went into Walmart and got my medication and picked these up. And I have to take a, a, a um, anti, uh, I don't know, keeps my blood from getting too thick. And I also take some other pills because I have a chemical imbalance in my body. And, um, of course, they're giving me a pill for my heart because I've got a heart problem. It's not blockage, and it's not really, it's not skipping a beat.
But sometimes my heart beats a little funny and gets a couple extra beats now and then. And I got some type of structure on the back of my heart. I guess I had been hurt through and accidentally getting electrocuted once. Uh, I do a lot of electrical, used to do a lot of electrical work. I was helping a friend out and I got shocked. And it didn't give me a problem until after I moved here to Georgia. And then I got um, a little bit of a problem. Well, anyhow, I'm going to shut this down, and thank you. Remember to like and subscribe. This is just a very simple video showing you this stuff. You have a good day, and you take care. Remember, hug your family. Remember to love your friends, love your family. Um, be good to people. All right. Make sure you prepare. Water, food, protection. Make sure you prepare, because you never know. People in Israel thought they were going to be okay. 1,400 people. And then, of course, we've got people in our own Congress, like I said in my last video, going around doing a bunch of different things. Uh, you know, people vote them in office. They get what they vote for, I guess. Remember, get out there and vote, people. Next election, get some of these people out of office. All right. Bye.